Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Animate tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to use guides, create guides, and use them for your animation. In this one, I've got a very simple and very ugly looking guide here. And just take a look. This here, this little line, acts as the guide. And then what I've done is I've got the ball here that I've created. I just created a little circle. And I've animated it so that it follows along the guide just like so. Very simple, very basic. The reason why you want to use guides, uh, A, it helps you with the animation, but B, the guides don't render in the final, I guess, the final project. So you can create a guide, and when you hit publish or when you hit render, it doesn't come out with it. So let me just delete this layer here. Hang on. And then, boom, I'm going to go ahead and I'm actually going to delete all the layers. I'm going to create a new layer, and we'll do it from scratch. So I'm just going to go ahead and delete this. And then bang, I've got layer one here. I've got nothing on it. So I'm going to go ahead and create a neat little blue ball just like that. And then I'm going to go ahead and select the selection tool. I'm going to move it up to the top left. I'm also going to increase, let's say I want this to be a three second animation. I'm going to go to the three second mark, which should be right about there. And I'm going to go ahead and insert a keyframe. So I'm going to click insert keyframe. And presto, we've now got a three second long animation or so. Okay, you should be able to follow along with me pretty clear here. The next step is I'm going to create a new layer. This is very important. You do not want to add this to the current layer. This is a new layer on its own. And I'm going to call this one guide. Oops. And I'm just going to call the bottom one ball just so it's nice and clear. Okay, good stuff. Now, for the make sure you're clicked on the guide layer or whatever you call it. And now I'm just going to go ahead and grab my, I'm just going to go ahead and grab my fluid brush tool. And you'll notice that I've got curve smoothing up. And what I want to do is I'm just going to draw a nice little path that I just kind of want to see this ball go down. So something like this. And then maybe we'll have the ball come up a little. Something like that. Okay, it doesn't really matter what the path looks like. It's the technique that matters. Now here's the important part. You want to click on guide. Now you want to right click on it and you're going to see that you have the option to go right click on the layer and then click guide. This now makes this a guide layer and again this will not then show up in the in the final published or the final exported document. Okay now let's go back to the ball layer and then I'm going to go and make sure that I've got Adobe I've got the <laughs> I've got the auto keyframe Adobe auto keyframe how's that for a mouthful. Okay I've got it selected which is what I want, and then bang, I'm going to go and we're going to animate, let's say, on the sixes. So every six frames, I'm going to move it forward a little bit, and I'm going to take this ball, and I'm going to move it to right about here. Okay, and then I'm going to go forward about another six frames. I'm going to take this ball, and I'm going to move it to right about here. Again, it doesn't have to be exact. It's just to show you the technique, and then I'm going to move it to here, and you'll see exactly what I'm doing, and so on. Okay, let's get to 24 and so forth. I'm going to move it to the edge and then I'm going to the 30 second frame, 30 frames, I'm going to move it into the middle here somewhere. Something like that. It doesn't really matter. Let's just go ahead and do the last two pieces very quickly. I'm going to move it to right about here and then I'm going to go to 42. I'm moving up by six every time and then I'm going to do another 48. I'm going to lift it up to about here let's say and then Finally, at 54 frames, I'm going to move it right about here, and then whatever. Last one. Let's go to 60. Yeah, we're going to go to 60. Sorry. Okay, good. Doesn't matter. Again, that will be done very quickly in the final process. Now, I'm going to go back, and I'm going to hit play, and you'll see what happens here. You'll see that it now moves along the path. Also, when I right-clicked on this guide, you will notice that it got a little, looks like a pickaxe. So you're basically turned it from a, uh, a page document into a pickaxe. And you can tell that this is a guide when you go up here and you go to the test movie. I'm going to left-click on it. Watch. There is no guide. This is what the final will look like, and it has no guide, guys. So that's how you create a guide, use a guide, use a guide to guide your motion, so to speak inside Adobe Animate. Thank you for watching. Ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned.